Well, hello everyone, this is Stevio. We are back in our homeowner series and we are expanding our lawn care business. Oh yeah, we got to expand it big time. Uh, right now we need to clear out some trees, so I'm trying to get all this tree trimming. Yeah, right, more like tree removal equipment here. And I'm having no problems getting over this roadway here. There we go. We got her now. Uh, yep. Bought the lot across from our uh, old business. Old, new business, if you want to say. And uh, got to clear out these trees so we can put a humongous building right there. There we go. Park right there. We got our truck here. Ready to fill up with some uh, with some tree limb trimming here. I got everything I should need. I did not spare any money whatsoever. I got the biggest, best equipment. Of course, I got the John Deere. They they make some good equipment. Yep, they do. Have to admit that this payloader here is just the coolest looking thing ever. I got. I don't even need a ramp. All right drive off oh whoa there we go see yep just a little seat bucking on there we're gonna use this to haul oh, oh almost hit a tree there gotta be careful gonna use this to uh move them trees out of the way after we uh saw them off this thing even sounds cool if you hear it beast mode i like that name the thing just looks too cool all right, now we get the fun mobile here. Uh, I never really use this, but it is kind of fun getting it on and off of this trailer. I can even send a type, a uh, email if I need to over here. Get everything in it. It's kind of weird because you do sit way at an angle here. Let's see. You can see all my uh, non-skills when it comes to a uh, tree removal here. Oh, there we go. Yep. Yep. That's why you got the tracks. We will try not to destroy their concrete too much here. Oh, yeah. Yep. Just eating through the concrete. Okay. Down. Oh. Down. Around. All right. Now we got to bear with me. I'm trying to figure out these controls. Oh, 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 yep, yep, yep. Found that one. Found that one. Here we go. Now we grab this thing. Nope, not that one. There we go. Oh. Alright, I had to uh, do a little learning off screen then. Trust me, I, 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 needed, I need some skills need some skill you guys are probably all yelling at your screen you are horrible yes 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 i'm trying to figure it out here we go okay here we go let the tree fall and cut them down there we go oh man we i guess i put all the branches into our uh window here hopefully it doesn't break there we go. Yep. Skills. I'm still learning. I'm still learning. Oh, well, now we're on the boom ha camera. Oh, a close-up look of this and my non-skills. There we go. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Sorry. Might get you a little sick there. Yeah, no one wants to see that camera all day. No. All right, now that we got some of these trees cut down, I think it's time to go beast mode. The beast puller. This thing, I mean, we need a mud pit so we can drive this through. This is almost looks like something that should be in another game. You guys know what I'm talking about. Yes, where you get to drive through the mud. Beast mode, look at it start up. Here we go. Actually, you know what? You know what? I think we should just use an easier thing here. We should just snap the fingers and let them all disappear. 
Voila! All done. Man, that was easy. Alright, now we just gotta load this big beast up. We should have some mowers coming in here real soon. Just in time to mow this down so the contractors can start building our new building. This stuff is high weeds and it is just thick. Look at that stuff. That is some thick grass right there. Alright, time to get all these wood chips out of here. We better, we better fold our tarp there just so we don't spread these all over the highway. Hopefully my load, my first shipment of a mower. Oh, wow, this is a tight turn there. Oh, yep, yep. Hopefully my first load of mowers should be in at any time. We got our last mower here. Oh, this is our last big mower, I should say. I bought me a freight shaker because you gotta haul this stuff around. You can't just uh, move this stuff around with a, a pickup truck or something. Oh yeah, I got my uh, 7R back there. Ooh, this is a little tricky trying to get over that bump. Definitely gonna have to uh, call the city and tell them to take care of that bump already. I'm tired of dealing with it. We, uh, one of our uh, contracted uh, haulers is already here. If you can see, we got the same version right in front of us. We'll leave a little gap. Maybe a little bit more of a gap here. There we go. Alright. We got a 7R, the new 7R here. We spared no expenses. We went full blur. I want everyone to see us and envy. Just be like, oh, I can't even compete. I'm just going to go bankrupt. Just don't even compete with me. All right. Start this girl up. Look at that beautiful piece of equipment. That is expensive. Trust me. Real expensive. Ugh. There we go. So we got a mower in the front here. Turn that bad chopper on. Yep, these will easily do the hillsides and everything. Let's see how this girl works here. Oh yeah. Yeah. She will do. She will do. Yep. Mows like a dream. Look at this. We can really fly with this girl. And when we're done with that main machine, looks like a torture device, doesn't it? Unfold the big bat wing. There we go. Look at that big girl. Lower her down. Start them things. Oh, we gotta see this. Look at that torture chamber down there. Can go like, with all the horsepower we have, this is a big new 7R with 310 horsepower. So it's nothing's lacking here. We're not even gonna even come close to bogging this girl down. Not even close. Cause I wanna get them huge contract, like maybe a golf course. Look at that just chops up that thick grass, that overgrown grass, so easily. Oh man, I forgot another stump there? Man, did that mower just saw that off like that? Or did I just leave it that short? I don't know. Just gotta clean up these few patches, and then we can jump up in that sky and start building us a building.
had to upgrade the truck too. I know it's a little overkill, just a little. Got the big Cummins. Got a little bit of a lift on it. Got about a five inch lift. That's nothing big. It's got a little roll we got to deal with here. Oh yeah, see? Nice and easy. I'll park this baby right into our brand new facility here. Whoo, look at all that. Yep, it's all ours. And man, is a bank payment huge. Love this heavy duty Dodge, man. I got the service bed on the back. I can service anything I need. Now, when the lawnmower breaks down, this is a truck that comes. Means I have to run. I got a deal. I got to get new contracts and all that. This is my primary baby. And I got to do all the fixing. Had to get the jaws in the front just for intimidation there. In the ranch hand. Because, you know, sometimes you got to beat down that brush so the mower can get over it. All right, I won't leave you guys in suspense any longer. Let's go over our lineup here. We got the John Deere 6310 here with a little planter there because you know what? Sometimes when you're doing landscaping, you got to plant that grass so you can mow it. Yeah, if it's not thick enough, you don't get that money, moolah. We got a John Deere mower here. Not for sure what type of mower this is. We got the big Duramax running here. Shut that girl off. The one ton with the dump bed works great when you got to do some little bit of landscaping, maybe get some rocks out of the way, or some lawn clippings. You never know whichever one. We got uh, the Baggett mower decks here with the ultimate uh, flip up trailer. Got a few uh, Baggett mowers here. Uh, got the another 6310 on a little planter there. Got a few setups of that. We got a few gators here. We got plenty of gators. We got a, the fertilized spreader here we use for fertilizing most of our lawn. We got a walker mower here. You know, just it's kind of our backup mower in case uh, one of the other mowers goes down. We use that. And uh, just for fun and excitement, especially when everyone wants to go out, have some fun, we got our rubber dinghy here because everyone likes playing with the I won't even say it. Uh, you know, sometimes we uh, we got a big crew here. Sometimes we need to uh, play around, let's say. So we go hop the dunes or something like that, or we go scouting for new contracts. Uh, I don't know. I have no idea, but it just is so dang cool. Why wouldn't you want one? Yeah, I better park this before I dent it up anymore. Man, looking good. We got our uh, little gazebo here, you know, some of our uh, some of our employees like smoking and this kind of keeps all them cigarette butts in one area so all our customers that show up here see our impressive lot don't get disgusted. We got another flip up trailer with a few uh, cheetahs on the back here. Of course, we got a little uh, dump box here on the back of this old one-ton Chevy Duramax. All the little clippings, everything like that, just go in the back. We got a genie because we had to build this place somehow. Of course, we have the genie lift there. And once again, the rubber dinghy. The rubber dinghy. Uh, in the winter time, when we're going to have to upgrade some of our snow clearing equipment, especially if we want to get into big uh, contracts. Some of them want an all encompassing contract, so we're going to have to get it. But for right now, we clear, clear off this yard with our gator here. Uh, we do have the two. 310 horse 7 R's here the 2020 editions with the low loader mowing decks and the bat wings on the back we got two of them we got another gator with a uh, three-point hitch this uh, mowing deck is a little big for the gators power let's just say that but uh, we're just kind of experimenting here uh, it would be nice if we could get a front uh, a front a front free point so we could just uh, mow from the front there and uh, you know 
everything is going autonomous. So we got two. We got a, the Magnum here. And we got on a Batwing. We're trying that out. Yep. You know, employees, they're expensive. Uh, they have to take breaks. This thing is good to go for hours and hours on end. We got the one ton dually here. Doesn't have, and we put this on the gooseneck and it is loaded down. This is, we come in force when we knock out a yard here. We got how many? Six mowers on the back here. It is loaded all the way to the brim. So we come there and customers are impressed when you got six mowers running around their yard really quick because they're just like in awe like holy cow can't believe how fast this is going we're trying out the john deere autonomous mower why not trying that on a bat wing uh the john deere in the case i mean we don't have all john deeres here we do have one case for all you case lovers there we did kind of go high on John Deere's just because we got a huge package, package deal for all of them together. You know, it's just too good. We couldn't pass it up. I want to have the biggest single landscaping business in the state here. It's a goal of mine. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you next time over here in Steve-O's Clippings. I gotta work on that. Ugh. Ugh. Make sure, like, share, and subscribe. Save it, too. It helps me out. Come on, all. We gotta beat that system. Thank you, all. Thank you all for watching. Like, comment, and share, and subscribe. Let's see what this baby can do. Ooh, yeah. Man, it gets up to top speed quickly, but doesn't really have that top of speed. Whoa! Oh, 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 we are off again.